This morning, the Virginia Hospital Center Foundation is working to help those who have helped so many during the pandemic. Now, frontline workers were on the receiving end of donations when the pandemic first hit, but now donations are dwindling. So good morning, Washington's Kristen Powers is live in Arlington right now with how you can help. Good morning to you, Kristen. Robert, good morning. And you know, these uh, hospital workers, they are still working so hard. So we really can't forget them. And doing such amazing work, the Virginia Hospital Center Foundation. Tony, uh, the president of the foundation here, what are you guys doing? Because you guys are nonstop helping out hospital staff here. Well, good morning, Christian. Thank you very much. You know, this we're 10 months into this pandemic, and the community's been so generous. Corporations, individuals, we've received over $1.2 million. And, cash contributions and thousands of meals and right now we're just out there urging the community to remember our frontline health care workers there's nothing better than a hot meal after working uh, you're halfway through a 12-hour shift in the midst of this pandemic and we're asking people to support our partnership with tryhungry.com yeah and such a great um thing to think about hillary phyllis we've been talking about this is that by providing meals you're letting the hospital staff do their job focus on these patients so you've been, you're doing the grunt work of all of this what are you seeing when it comes to hospital staff uh, right now they've been doing this for months so the hospital staff are working their hearts out and getting a meal is probably one of the best parts of their day i would say it's a huge morale booster and it's all thanks to the community and we're helping our patients and the community is helping us. So this is a partnership that you guys are doing. Uh, what are you asking people to donate? Could they do meals or a cash donation is best? What are you asking? So we're asking uh, for food donations or for financial donations, which can be put towards meals. All right, and you are so dedicated in this. You gave us your direct contact information. So if you want to get in contact with Hillary, just head right now to WJLA.com. But again, frontline heroes, guys, they are working tirelessly uh, throughout this pandemic. And these food donations are going to healthcare workers who are working directly with COVID-19 patients. So, you know, even as the season of giving, as we call it, kind of wraps up, we want to make sure that we are still giving to the people who are working on the front lines. Back to you. Absolutely. Very true. And for more information on that, you could also check my Twitter at ABC7, Robert.